Will you get misty while watching this miniature get painted? Let's find out. Hey folks, hope you're having a good day. I'm back with another rogue and this is Mist. He's primed in wolf gray and we're starting off with an actual army painter speed paint hive dweller purple. You know why I want to use a speed paint? Because I want to see what it was on top of a different color for a primer. And you know what? The hive dweller purple on top of wolf gray gave exactly what I wanted. A beautiful purple color with a little undertone of a light blue coming through and it just looks amazing on this miniature next we're using a little bit of cobalt skin we're gonna be putting this on this little flap he has coming down after his armor and if you guys like what you're i'm um, doing and you want to support the channel hit that little link that just popped up and send me a virtual tip it's much appreciated and will help me reach my goals and get this channel even further All right, next we're going to be using a shining silver metallic paint. Uh, this is going to be for all his armor on his boots, on his shoulder pads, but not that armor on the front chest plate. That's going to be a totally different color. This was a super easy miniature to paint. Uh, just, I'm, I'm really enjoying these massive darkness miniatures so far. They're actually very simple, not tons of details, and you can get them done quickly. And especially if you're like me and you're not a really big master painter, but you just like to have something that's not gray plastic on the table. Uh, these Massive Darkness heroes so far, like I said, are amazing. I'm assuming that the minions and that, well, the bosses and the roaming monsters are going to be a different story. Using a little bit of Baltazar Gold now, this is Citadel Paint. We're going to be using that on his chest plate. Uh, this is a beautiful gold it is not too bright but it also has a little dark hue to it as well and we're going to spice that up a little later with something different as well hey folks and if you're enjoying these videos hit that like button and if you're new to the channel which most of you are please consider subscribing as it helps grow the channel and maybe one day we'll hit that 1000 mark Now we're going to be doing all that wonderful smoke that is appearing out of this miniature with some ash gray. Now I made sure this was not too thick and going on because I wanted some of that blue to pop out anyways again. Because it's got like a grayish blue hint to it in the uh, artwork and I want to stay as close as possible to the artwork. I love staying close to the artwork. I don't, I don't usually go away from what they do. Sometimes I do when I can't see the miniature properly on the artwork and sometimes I'll look it up on uh, Google and stuff like that on the internet and see if uh, I can find some inspiration if I can't figure out what I want to do but usually I try and stick to it. Uh, Alright, we're going to use a little bit of hardened leather, another speed paint by the Army Painter, and we're going to be using this on that actual cobalt skin, so that little drape, because it was the same color almost as the armor, but it's uh, like a silk, so I wanted to give it that same color by using that hardened leather, which is perfect. Ice Storm is next. We're doing this on so his eyes and the skin of his hands, so this is like a very light blue, and it's because he doesn't have skin on his hands. It looks like, like the smoke is his hands. It's a really cool miniature. Uh, some bleach skull to do with just a touch of dry brush on all those little smoky areas just so when I do the next part uh, We're not in the next part, but the part later on golden griffin now on that armor just to give a little different kind of shine And this is where we finish off the miniatures with the runic gray We're gonna be putting this it's a speed paint by the way And we're gonna be putting this on top of all the smoke and it's gonna give a gray blue White misty look to it, just like I said, amazing. What I, I I'm very proud of what I did on this one. I don't know if you guys are, and I hope you are. And if you are, hit the like button. That doesn't hurt you, and it doesn't give you, it doesn't cost you anything. Subscribe for the for for all I care. Actually, it'd be great too. All right, there you go, folks. Mist is painted, ready for the table. Add a little bit of dark earth to the to the base, black rim, and we're good to go. I want to thank you guys for watching. We'll see you in the next one.